Good morning, everyone. Last night, I had the privilege of saying the Yisker in the Jacksonville community's Yom HaZikaron event. And it made me think, what is Yisker? Remember. Remembering what? Yes, we're remembering our loved ones. Remembering those that sacrificed their life for the security of the land of Israel, for the people of the land of Israel, that we could go to the Kotel, that we could pray, that we could learn, that we could go to the beaches. There's a lot of things that we were remembering. But at the end of the Yisker, it says, and their souls are bound in the bound of life and are in Gan Eden, Garden of Eden. We say Amen. Yiskar is more than just a physical remembering, a remembering of the past, a remembering of the good times. But Yiskar is also for us to remember that we are more than just a materialistic body, a physical body. We have an Ashama, we have a soul, and is living forever. And of course, we're in pain because we are physical people, materialistic people, and we're feeling the loss of these young chayalim, these young soldiers, the young people that died in bombs and other things, or older people. It doesn't make a difference. But at the same time, it should be an encouragement when we say Yisker. We know that their life is not over. They're going to a better place, a spiritual place place of all spirituality and as we said the Gan Eden Nishmasham in the Garden of Eden may their Nishama their soul be resting so let's all reflect on this important day of remembrance let's all focus on the loved ones and pray that we will see them soon and also remember words of encouragement that they're with us still. Their neshama, their soul, is never gone. Wishing everyone a beautiful day and a day of memories. Yom Hazikaron.